making his way to the ring from parts unknown. Weighing in at 323 pounds, Kane! After rising from the ashes, Kane continues to live a tortured existence and is hungry for revenge. Pure demonic rage in his eyes. Feeding off the infernal flames of hell. Oh, yeah, I am pumped for this guy. And his opponent from Detroit, Michigan, weighing in at 295 pounds, the Beast Ryan Ali. A matchup like this, it's one that the locker room has wanted to see. It's one that the WWE Universe has wanted to see. It's one that I've been waiting to see, and it's about to go down. Sticks, garbage cans, chairs, ladders, throw in the kitchen sink because you get nailed with anything in an extreme rules match. Now, this is the epitome of carnage and chaos where anything can turn into a lethal weapon. Which is why it is crucial to exploit a weakness as soon as it's discovered. Down to Odin and a double axe handle smash. Ah, clubbing blow to the back. Ooh, oh, what a punch. That's how you stop your opponent. Kane blazing a following trail of destruction. There's no stopping the big red monster. Backbreaker. Hope it ended here. He throws a shoulder up before two. Looking for a speedy pinfall there. Saw that one coming. Suplex. Heads out and he has all the time he wants. He grabbed the rattle. This is either going to pay off or completely backfire. Spine Buster. He's lost some of his win now. Kane came looking for a fight and is delivering one right now. In this type of match, Byron, how does a superstar combat against the fact that they could fall victim to a vicious and hellacious attack? Well, the difficult part is once an opponent gets the upper hand, you have to stop the onslaught yourself. There are no rope breaks, no five counts. Yeah, the referee is truly only there to count pinfall attempts and check to see if a combatant submits. I don't know what they're looking for here. He's got the table, and I can only imagine what he's thinking of doing with it. He's reaching under the ring for anything useful. It's like I always say, he who has the sledgehammer has the last laugh. These are dangerous attacks on their own, but now the damage is exponentially multiplying. A well-timed dodge. And now gets tossed into the ring, clearly hoping something nefarious is beneath the ring. The universal signal for extreme. The kendo stick has entered the fray. Oof. What offense from the big red monster. Everything's in Kane's favor now. He switches it back around. Oh, this is one of the most incredible comebacks that I think I've ever witnessed. This Very awesome. impressive. You're absolutely right, Michael Cole. This is what you call stepping up in the moment. Knife edge chop echoing through the arena. He's outside the ring now. Hope he's got a plan. About to introduce some metal into the mayhem in the form of the trash can. Coming back in the ring. Tossed into the corner. Wicked clothesline. And he goes for the pin. Oh my, how in the world did he keep? 
kick out of that. It's not over yet. Plenty left to go in this one. He gets out of the way. Not the position you want to be in right now. Can't prepare your face for that. Just using their foot as a weapon. So ruthless. Oh, what a close line. Climbing up top. He's got big plans. From the top. Diving headbutt. He is just reeling from that offense. Well, you don't sign up for an Extreme Rules match not knowing the consequences, Cole. So, so close. That could have been it. Oh, God. He's getting fired up now, really feeding off this crowd. What's Kane? Uh-oh. Kane gets that set right back to him. In position, ready to strike. Here it comes. Planted with a wicked DDT. Great counter. Last second knee to the face there. Sent to the outside on the apron. Dangerous situation for both competitors. He broke him in half. He's looking for an implement of destruction under the ring. Bringing out that kendo stick means he is truly willing to go to the extreme. A steady stream of moves taking out Kane. The big red monster showing weakness here. Climbing up to the top now. Getting up, but doesn't have a clue what's coming at him. From the top. Oh, God, that, that, that's a bad landing. A terribly risky move, and it did not pay off. Icarus could have done it better. He's looking a little worried now. That kind of offense from Kane being fueled by Hellfire and Brimstone. Oh, tracking the kendo stick across the head. And he gets set back into the ring. He's heading back to the ring. Oh my, down with authority. Oh, kick right to the gut. Another. And another one. Oh, and a close line to follow. Lining it up. Going to cut him in half. Spear. Will Kane get back up? It's almost there. Yeah, victory. A win. Here is your winner. The Beast. Kane was defeated before our very eyes. The devil's favorite demon may have been on the losing end tonight, but you can bet he's already drawing up a sadistic plan for revenge.